Oh, welcome back my gardening friends. Just an update on the uh, grow room and the greenhouse grow room. Uh, this is an update on the uh, Viper Spectra LED grow lights. Uh, these have uh, got the uh, dimmer switch right on the end now. I've turned it right down at the moment just so that we can uh, see what we're doing. Uh, here's some uh, radish uh, that we've got uh, going. Did we put a date on those? Uh, we planted those on the 8th of the 1st. I didn't show you on my last update. And in the bottom there, we've got some uh, lettuce. And uh, it's not coming through at the moment. Uh, I took Brian's advice about turning the lights off in here, especially for some of the chilli peppers. I've put these uh, back on uh, at the moment and brought some things back in. But we've got some... Uh, onions there in the middle of the screen uh, some of the long carrots at the back getting used to this new tablet guys the camera's on the left hand side so I'm not where I'm pointing it it isn't uh, where you can see and we've got some kurobi no pak choy sorry I can't even use uh, my wiggle finger now because I'm on the wrong side so let's swap hands right where well, there's my finger so there's the uh, the pak choy and some other bits there all coming through nicely some of the uh, giant uh, cabbages uh, sorry giant beetroots swiss chard you can see i'm having terrible problems here some spring onions oh dear I'm getting used to this spinach i say some of the radishes there and uh, there we have the uh, broccoli perennial uh, that I had sent me still got some peppers left on there need to get them off they ain't gonna last much longer and a few other things I'll just take you off the tripod because I'm making a, a right hash of this but uh, we'll just turn the uh, light up to maximum now I don't know whether you're getting that but uh, yeah the Viper Spectra again only a penny uh, an hour to run good solid light and the dimmer switch just come in really handy and I do think I need to get some of that uh, red pak choy sorted that might be a call for gritting no, it was only Mrs. K checking up on me. <laughs> There's my tea bags drying. May as well use the warmth and the light to, to do that. I'll just crawl under here. And uh, the... Uh, oh, see, I'm still facing the wrong way. There's the rocket two seed planted on the 28th of uh, December 21. And uh, it's uh, just started to uh, come through. Nothing on the other one. But if you remember, there was uh, a chit on uh, that one and I'm still using my finger uh, I've got my condor potatoes in here and um, get them to start chitting and we've got some other plants in here the giant cabbage why am I saying cabbage I love me cabbage but these are the uh, giant uh, beetroot more tea bags there more tea bags there they need uh, sorting and I've got three trays under there as well The onions I need to get those in as you can see they're a bit leggy never mind it's been one of those years I've still got to uh, sort this uh, solar panel out I don't know whether it works yet or not uh, but I might just connect it up to what I've already got if not I'll put this one in a frame and I'm gonna put this uh, by the pond and uh, have uh, water flowing uh, all year round hopefully Another project. No, we're not going to play football with this uh, barrel. Uh, this is going to be for the uh, condors. Uh, I'm still trying to point with my finger. I have to get used to holding the tablet and holder with my right hand. Uh, but uh, yes, going to where the black lines are are the cut marks. Two potatoes in there in the circles, and the bits there will be the hinges. 
save cable tying them up if it doesn't work i can cut a bit more off but i thought that would just help hold everything together let's go and have a look at my seed potatoes that we've saved from my own stock uh, in the outside fridge well in my shed should we say and these are the eggshells i've got to blend these i've got one two three buckets full that need uh, drying we'll get them dried in the summer and get them blended and i've still got uh, 12 boxes of these uh, apples i'll keep sorting through them these are the ones that people put out at the front of their houses and say help yourself to a few yes a few a few so here's my fridge and here's the potato so in a previous video you saw me come on focus uh, we got the pink fur apple uh, with some found white the kestrel allens uh, we've got the purple that we found on plot one we've got rocket potatoes there it's my sarpo mira uh, some marfonia that i bought uh, five years ago and uh, some spare condors and uh, some king edwards the king edwards i found on uh, another plot when we was uh, revamping it and tidying it up and there's the uh, tomatoes that we just placed on top of the compost we'll be taking those into the grow room later on warm them up and we'll have our own seed i'll just chuck them on the top i don't dry them don't do nothing with them uh 20th of the 10th oh, hang on look i ain't even 20th of the 10th we pop those in there and it looks like one it's just sticking up there a little bit it's gone moldy has uh, tried to sprout at some stage but the fridge isn't on and I don't normally uh, shut the door to uh, let it get a little bit of air circulation but that's uh, ideal it does work it's an old fridge recycled and uh, hopefully Mrs K doesn't realize when I switch it on so we're up the side where all the bins are there's me eggshells my mother saves me some as well the banana skins tea bags and then uh, just the ordinary uh, kitchen waste for the compost bin save as much as we can and uh, I found another couple of uh, cans uh, they've had uh, shampoo in uh, it looks like somebody's uh, washed them out already because there wasn't any froth they'll be ideal for my fish poop so I'll empty that out now just in case there's anything else in there that we don't want so really pleased with how the uh, Viper Spectra is uh, done uh, in my uh, growing spaces I do move them about a bit and uh, I'm hoping to uh, have a few early salad crops uh, in the uh, greenhouse grow room and I'll update you on that as soon as I've got more plants in there and I've got all the lights on. Happy gardening to you all. Till next time my friends. Ta-ra for now.